And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast, weather from where you live. We're going to have a lot of sunshine this morning, so that's great news and the sun will last throughout the uh, late morning, early afternoon, a little bit more clouds, but it's also a little hazy out there this morning, but the skies will remain clear and we're also going to add in a little bit more wildfire smoke starting really this morning and throughout the day tomorrow. So right now we're all clear, just some haziness to those skies, a little bit of fog in our northeastern counties and really across the entire viewing area, less than probably about five miles visibility, not too bad driving wise, but just be aware of that. 57 degrees here in Lafayette, 55 in Frankfurt, 54 in Winnemac 57, Kokomo 55. Good morning to you in Peru. So for today, again, a lot of sun this morning, and then we'll get up to 82 very quickly this morning because that's west southwest wind bringing in that warmth ahead of a cold front that's going to be working in this evening. Notice the wind change from southwest west to no northwest this afternoon. We'll have a 20 to 40 percent coverage of some of these scattered to isolated storms. We'll get up to 89 degrees today. It'll feel pretty warm out there, especially come noontime. So Futurecast will show here's some of that fog that may develop this morning in some of our northeastern counties, but then that'll clear up. We'll see a lot of sun here even at one o'clock looking pretty good, but watch what happens right after two, three o'clock. Some scattered showers and storms start to develop. Here's the cold front. It'll start to sag southward. Here's 630 coming through Lafayette, Monticello. Peru, some scattered showers here. And with the wildfire smoke, that kind of puts a lid on the atmosphere. It kind of uh, soaks in all the sun's rays. So it add, acts as a kind of a capping mechanism for these storms. So they won't get very tall. So we're not looking at a severe chance like we normally would in this scenario. But overall, some scattered showers and storms likely through about 8 to 9 o'clock. Once the sun sets, the cold front sags south will clear out tonight and we'll still deal with some wildfire smoke for tomorrow. And you can see that here on our smoke thickness map uh, going into today. You can see pretty reds and oranges indicating just some very high thickness of some of these clouds high up in the atmosphere. And some may mix down on Friday once the cold front passes this evening, which will usher in a little bit more for tomorrow afternoon. So that'll make for a very uh, reddish sunrise tomorrow morning. 59 by 9 we will get up to only 80 degrees for Friday, a fairly pleasant day for tomorrow with those hazy, smoky skies. Now going beyond Friday, we will be seeing plenty of sun Friday going into Saturday as well, looking good. But Sunday morning may add a little bit more clouds. We'll be watching the system of the southwest. We may see an isolated chance Sunday evening going into Monday, uh, but the chances are very low and most of it's going to stay south of the viewing area. So my current thoughts are we're going to stay fairly dry for the next several days and Saturday for the taste looks great. 85 degrees, 87 for Father's Day and just those low chances of an isolated shower or storm Sunday into Monday and then we'll likely stay about near or above normal for those afternoon high temperatures going into next week for the first day of summer. 84 degrees Wednesday we will stay in the 80s with maybe some more storm chances by Thursday, Friday of next week, Joe. All right. Well, that wildfire smoke is back. We, we oh, all yeah. saw the images in New York of the, <laughs> the apocalyptic <laughs> oh, scene yes. that it looked like yeah. there. I, I'm guessing we, we don't, don't need to expect that here in Lafayette. No, it's, it's not going to be apocalyptic <laughs> or looking like Mars outside, but you'll definitely notice kind yeah. of the haziness of the sky like we saw a couple weeks ago. Yeah. And, uh, like that. So just be aware of that. Otherwise, you know, watch the radar this afternoon. A couple of scattered storms may be possible, so that might uh, put a hinder on some plans if you have some things to do outside this afternoon. Yeah, but looking like a good weekend, so that's yeah, great news. Not too bad. All right, thanks, David. Mm -hmm. and